In a world first flight and a significant step for human medicine, a University of Maryland drone delivered a kidney to a Baltimore hospital in April, where doctors then transplanted the organ into a patient. Many see huge potential for unmanned aircraft systems, or UAS, delivering medical products, with some drones already doing so in Africa. The U.S. flight required a specially designed drone which was able to maintain and monitor the organ. We have eight motors to provide redundancy in case we have some failures. There's also a parachute recovery system. In case the entire aircraft fails, we can still get it down safely and the organ will be safe. Their drone-delivered kidney was implanted into 44-year-old Baltimore resident Trina Glipsy, who spent eight years on dialysis before undergoing the procedure. According to the United Network for Organ Sharing, which manages organ transplants in the U.S., in 2018, there were nearly 114,000 people on waiting lists, with 1.5% of organs not making it to the destination and nearly 4% being delayed by two hours or more. The test flight was a brief three miles, but University of Maryland Medical Center transplant surgeon Dr. Joseph Scalia said it represents the potential for many more lives to be saved. If you called me and told me that you had a marginal kidney that I know would be of potential benefit to my patient, but that it's not going to get here for a long time, we may say, you know what, that's just too much risk. But now, in a system where we've innovated the amount of time that, it, that, that can elapse between the the recovery hospital and the implantation hospital, we may be able to accept that organ. So we think as many as 2,500 kidneys a year could be added to the pool. Beverly Sison, UNTV News and Rescue, USA.